So today I got Lucky Heartsog on the server. I saw his post on Reddit about his sail ship, which was pretty awesome because uh, I put one up myself. And um, like I say, more sail ships is like awesome. So here we are. Just gonna have a look at the uh, detail on his actual sail. And like I say, his look a little bit better than mine where I've done the sail edges. I do like the way he's done this. It's got a much better style just... with the blue. I like it. It's, it's the same concept, obviously, oh. but it's just tidier. His pattern's tidier. Mine's a bit, even when I look at mine, it's a bit messy. And also, he's, I... made, um, he's made good use of symmetry here. Yeah, exactly. And also the fins in the middle of his sails. I really like those. They're awesome. It's like, it's like attention to t detail. It's like you, some things really work and other things don't work as much. But this sort of using the wedges to sort of sort of clamp the water there with the crystal, it's it's worked really well. I think that works brilliantly. You can see where it almost looks like there's a shadow at the edge low as well, which is awesome. Um, when I'm looking down here, it appears like there's a big corridor. I'm hoping to have a look around the inside of this in a sec. Um, I think these must be some kind of turret. Um, they do look like turrets because they're docked in. And they're a little bit more stylized than mine. Mine were just giant waffles. So these look better, you know, they look, I think they have a much more definitive style to them. And I like how he's used a lot of hollow space with lighting as well from the crystal. That's a really nice touch. Um, I really like this, I think this looks awesome. Uh, might even copy something like that in a future build of my own and um, yeah he's got a nice docking ring I'm a fan of the docking rings docking rings are awesome and he's got four turret points around the side just like me only he's gone for a sort of hexagonal take on it I think hexagonal yeah yeah so that's that's brilliant and uh, I like what he's done oh. here as well with the extenders kind of looks cool I've never seen that done before and not, I've yeah. noticed it seems to be missing gravity blocks. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. And then obviously he's got a dock on the back for his shuttle. I believe that's his shuttle. I mean, it could just be another turret, actually. Maybe I missed... Yeah, actually it is. It's just... It's another turret. I think it, yeah, it is. It's, it's another turret. Or is it? No. That is his shuttle, isn't it? Yeah, that's his ship. Hey. I'm going to start asking him some questions. He's I'm calling say, it an escape shuttle, actually. It's an escape shuttle. Right, cool. Right, so let's see. I'm going to ask him about the interior and we'll take a little look. So, uh, I've been directed over to the doors and we're taking a little look here. Oh no, I've still got gravity on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, speaking of which, I really wish there was gravity in here. It's, just, it's all right, eventually it'll just wear off because I'll get far enough away. Let's see, uh, he's not saying it. Tell me if he says anything, dude, because I can't see the chat at the moment. Ah, uh, oh, there we go, I think. Yeah, we go. I've broken gravity now. I like this corridor though. It's 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 really blue, but he's made it work with the, you know, exposing his energy reactors in the corridor walls. I think that's quite cool. And there's another entry point right here into the ship. Nice. And the ship core is right there. Weird. Oh, there's the ship core. I was going to say I couldn't see it. I like how he's embedded it in the wall. Got to say. Yeah, you, it's hard to see wh when you're passing by it because it's hidden in a shadow. So there it is. I think it's a beautiful design. All those wedges go together. When you look at it from far away, it just looks like lots of windows or maybe girder like structure. The uh, edges on his sails are quite nice as well. It looks looks plated. It's very nice. Obviously, as a sail ship, we're not really too interested in like the uh, power or anything like that. But um, we are interested in its dimensions. So this one has a thrust of 1,000, a mass of 748, and uh, a length of 115 meters and a height of 67 meters with a width of 101 meters. So it's not quite two to one thrust, which is what we wanted. We wanted somewhere between one to one and two to one thrust, so they're not too fast. Um, everything else is up to you for the design of these, because we want them to sail, not rocket along. <laughs> I like his sail design. 
it's cool like everyone comes up with a different sail design this is why I want more people to show me their sail ships because you know you'd be surprised you could come up with the a really unique design it's quite easy with symmetry as well you just sort of get into it it's quite an artistic sort of thing to get get and do so yeah this was the ship I'm just gonna get the name Okay, so great big thanks to Lucky Hartzog for contacting me and uh, coming along to the server. I'm looking forward to the space regatta. If anyone else wants to enter their solar ship, please get in touch and uh, we'll feature it. So, thanks for watching yet again and I will see you in the next one.